Hey there, welcome to Tech Terminal and today we'll be taking a look how to set up proxy in Windows 8.1 and this is for educational purposes only, don't use proxy for bad stuff. Okay, that was the disclaimer, you heard it guys, I'm not responsible. So the thing is we use proxy to access some blocked sites or for some personal reasons, I don't know why, but because my ISP is having some issues previously they were allowing me to open up some particular videos sites so I decided to use proxy to gain access and sure enough proxy helped me and when I asked them about this why are you guys not doing this like not fixing this it was opening fine previously and their answer was we'll check on it and it's been three days they're not checking on it so I thought well why not make a tutorial on proxy because it helped me it may help you guys as well so the first thing that we need to do is check that what's the issue so let me open up chrome yeah this is a test user so i'm gonna open up youtube and i'm gonna open up any videos for example okay don't judge me see ya so let's open this one okay this says the uploader has not made this video available in your country whereas this video was accessible previously damn it okay so this video was accessible previously i did ask my friends who are here like near my house and in this country so they could open it whereas i couldn't there's something wrong so what i did was i opened up ip chicken which checks for the ip address that you currently have your live ip address and this is my live ip address which i would definitely blur out because i don't want to see like i don't want to show you guys and even on google what's my ip and here we have the same ip as well so currently this is not working we can always go ahead and go to settings and like manually set up a proxy server but for this tutorial we're gonna set up the whole network that's coming into windows 8.1 as a full-on proxy server instead of setting it up in individual browser which you can do as well it's your personal wish but i'm gonna do that because i want all my connection through proxy so for that we need to go to proxy settings which you can find like just search for proxy network proxy settings it should land you on this page your one may be on automatic so what we're gonna do is turn off that and turn on proxy servers over here we're gonna enter the proxy address and the port the port number of the proxy and by this time you might be asking where well, where do i get this proxy servers i don't have anyone okay so you don't get the proxy servers easily there is a site i'll link it it's from hide my ass okay don't take it bad but it is hide my ass and you can get the proxies from there as well you can search for your correct proxy uh, like the one that's near you or the one that has a better connection with your IP with your ISP so I already have my proxy ID set up like like my IP address I already have it with me so I'm just gonna paste it and I'm gonna I know the port that's 80 and I'm gonna save it so as you guys remember previously we could not open this up so now if we re refresh the browser and there we go it's now perfectly opening wow that's great it worked so now i can watch all my videos completely without any hesitation or anything so 720 1080 no buffer and you might be asking well what happened to the ip chicken and what happened to what's my prop like what's my ip so in google it actually updates the new ip that actually is connecting to youtube and in ip chicken i don't know what happens so the thing is, by this time you may ask him, well, how does a proxy actually work? Proxy is completely like a middleman. They are like the place where the YouTube video is being buffered to a certain location and your connection is being connected to that certain location instead of being directly connected from YouTube to your home. Okay, so that that's how proxy works. And as you can see, this is completely working fine. I'm going to mute this because of copyright issues and stuff and yeah so so that actually helped so if i go back and turn off the proxy server and if i minimize this 
and if I refresh, as you can see, it's not working because of the proxy error. Because my ISP is having some issues and ISP, if you're watching this, then please fix it. Testing, if this happens to you, if you live somewhere where you cannot access the content, then always you can use proxy, but it is not recommended in a good way. But if you want, you can use it if you really want to get that content. Like if it was being accessed previously, but due to some mistake or due to some issues by your ISP, you can't access it right now, then go ahead and use proxy. So you have to go to this address proxylist.hidemyass.com and over here you can search for all the ports, all the protocols and whatever you want you can actually use their proxy like the ones that they use. So as you can see there are a bunch of proxies like the speed from my ISPs connect like from my connection to the connecting server that's in Romania the speed is not at all good but the connection time is good so I want a proxy that has a good connection time and a good connection speed so for example doo -doo 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 -doo, okay all of these suck I don't want I don't want slow speed I want full speed update the damn results okay. so these are some proxies that I can use one is in Germany, one's in China, one's in Vietnam, one's in Thailand, Brazil. So these are all the proxies that I can use and kind of bypass the security check or something that you might want to say and access the content. So yeah, that was it guys. And if you like this video then please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe for more contents on technology tips, tutorials and more. And I'll see you again in my next video. Bye.